Rachna and I'm back with a new lesson. In today's lesson, I'm going to teach you how to use as in different sentences. Okay, so I have a few examples here for you. Now we use as when we when you want to say two things happened at the same time or over the same period of time. So for example, I watched her as she opened the door. So there were two things happening. You were watching her and she was opening the door. So when you want to talk about two actions that happen at the same time, you use as. Now in my next example, turn off the lights as you go out. So again, there are two actions happening at the same time. You're going out and then you're turning out the lights. Please remember we use as only when you want to talk about two things that happen at the same time or over the same period of time. When one action follows the other, you do not use as like this. Okay, so when I had reached home, I took a bath. Now there are two things happening, but one happened after the other. It's not happening at the same time. So first I reached home and then I took a bath. So here, please remember you cannot say as I had reached home. This is wrong because one action is following the other. So please remember you use as when two things happen at the same time. Now let's take a look at just as. Just as we use just as when you want to say something happened exactly at that moment. For example, John arrived just as I left. Now friends, you can even use this without just. You can say John arrived as I left. But when you use just, it emphasizes that it happened exactly at that moment. So exactly when I left, John arrived. In my next example, I had to leave just as the conversation was getting interesting. So when the conversation began uh, to get interesting, that is the time I had to leave. So exactly at that time, I had to leave when the conversation got interesting. So I hope these two examples are clear to you. You use it when two things happen at the same time or you use just as when you want to say something happened exactly at that moment. Now I'm going to be back and show you more uses of as in different sentences. Okay, so we use as when you want to say because or give reasons. For example, as I was feeling tired, I went to bed early. So because I was feeling tired, I went to bed early. In my next sentence, as they live near us, we see them quite often. So because, so you're giving a reason, so you say as they live near us, so because they live near us, we see them quite often. Okay, I'm sure this is clear to you. Let's, let's move on to the next example. Now we use as when you talk about someone's job or when you want to say how something is used. For example, a few years ago, I worked as a teacher. That means I was a teacher a few years ago. Okay. For example, your friend works um, as a manager in a company. Okay. Let's move on to the next example. We use the garage as a workshop. Now here you are saying how you make use of something. So you use your garage as a workshop. Well friends, I hope these two points are clear to you and now we'll take a look at some more sentences how to use as. Okay, so now let's take a look at how we use as if. Now we use as if when you want to say how someone looks, sounds or feels. So when you're trying to relate someone to the manner in which they look, sound or feel, you use as if. For example, Kelly sounds as if she's got a cold. So here you're trying to say that you know, she sounds as if she's got a cold. Now friends, please remember you can even use as though. 
in place of as if. Okay. So let's move on to the next example. The house looked as if nobody lived in it. So here you're relating as if and trying to show that the house is empty as though no one lived in it. So again, you can use as though. Okay. And in my third example, I don't feel as if I've had a vacation. Probably you've come back very tired and you just feel it, it hasn't been a vacation for you. So you are describing your feeling and relating it. So you use as if. So I hope this part is clear to you. Now let's see how you use as if when you want to say how someone does something. For example, he ran as if he were running for his life. Now here you are trying to describe the manner of him running or the way he was running. So you say as if when you want to say or when you want to express how someone does something. In my next example, after interruption, she continued talking as if nothing had happened. So here you are trying to show the manner in which she was talking after she was interrupted. So you use as if. Well, so please remember you use as if to say how someone looks, sounds or feels and when you want to describe uh, or when you want to show how someone does something. So, well uh, friends, these are a few uses of as in different sentences. I hope you've understood this lesson and I'm sure you're going to find it very useful. Please do put in your comments and queries if any and I'm going to be back soon with a new lesson. Till then, take care and bye.